Well, we've just seen a five-star performance by a five-star racehorse. He's a two-year-old son of giving the green light, bred at Fast Fontaine Stud and owned by the Becks. Uh, well done to everybody concerned, Sean Terry, Richard Faree. Nice to have Avi on course uh, to represent the guys. And of course, the gentleman that takes care of him is Tandile Mjaka, who's done an outstanding job. Tandile being given his 2,000 Rand by Chairman of Gold Circle Racing Club and a Director of Gold Circle. We welcome Mayesh Chetty to Hollywood Bet Scottsville. Thanks, Mayesh, for coming down and assisting us with the winning presentation. Well done to you, Tandile. Outstanding job. You know, really nice horses found you at the stable of Sean Terry. Well done to you, Tandile. 2,000 Rand. Hollywood Bets and Gold Circle. And first up, we'll have the winning jockey, Richard Faree, and he's going to tell us a bit more about a five-star performance. Richard, I can't think of uh, you know, <laughs> superlatives to try and describe this victory because for us racing fans to watch a performance like that from a young horse, I think the floor is yours because that turn of foot was something special. Look, uh, from the one, he's just given you that feel of a, a quality animal and... Uh, you know, he, he, he gives it all um, when you ask him. But today he showed a lot of greeniness and uh, I went through a gap through the 500 and the moment he almost got to the front, he saw the stage and he ran in quite badly, you know, and was a bit concerned that I might not have been clear enough from those horses yet, but uh, he, he is a two-year-old. We must remember that first time at Scottsville. Um, you know, so they, they're going to see this tower of a building and you know all the glass and the mirrors reflecting back at them and uh, he, he was green um, I was in front quite early uh, pricked his ears and then I was getting a bit nervous because I felt the system you know playing caution and slowing down a bit but uh, he he did it enough he quickened well um, I just kept riding him and keep shouting at him just to keep that momentum going but like I said always showed qu uh, quality and class so to Mr. Terry well done to the owners sensation. Uh, it's always a great pleasure to ride winners in, in these silks. So uh, also to the sponsors, um, thank you very much and to my sponsors at Winning Form. Well just to put a little net in out, he's a horse that possibly gives you the confidence to ride him the way you did because you know that when you're going to press the engines are going to open up. Yeah, it's a luxury of actually knowing what you're riding. Uh, got some experience with him and he leaves a yeah, 100% strike rate in his, in his career, so that's brilliant. And also to Mrs. Geriatrics, uh, the, the rates are 100%, uh, so that's beautiful stuff. Well, you know, your day hasn't ended yet, but what a dream day it's turning out for you. Yeah, it's not finished yet, so we've got some work to do, so thank you to everyone. Well done. Winning jockey Richard Faree will receive his momentum from uh, Myers Chetty, chairman of Gold Circle Racing Club and director of Gold Circle. Next up, let's have Sean Terry. Now, you heard the numbers that Sean's goal on the Hall of Fame, the role of honor at Hollywood Bet Scottsville, and he adds another one to that. This place has been really good to you and kind to you, but you need the horses to prove themselves, and horses have found you, and you've done the job with them over a number of years now. Yeah, listen, it's been a happy hunting ground. Uh, it always seems to fall into place this time of my season. I seem to be going at my best at this time of the season. We do often start off slow, but it, it works for me. Uh, yeah, I must just say it is, a, it is an honor and, it, and uh, a privilege to, to have the horses that I've had through my hands that have actually won these races. Um, as you say, you can't do it without the horse. But I must just thank, obviously, the team at home. Uh, I failed to thank them uh, for the last start, but without their work, it's, it's, it's impossible. Obviously, guys are committed. They travel down on the floats with them. Assistants that are not well travel down. They do their work. There's no clock watching. So a very committed team, and I must just say thank you very much. And then I also left out Clifton Stud in my last interview. Very well done to them. But uh, to Fosfontein Stud over here, exceptional quality horse. I must just say to my son Daniel, well done, because uh, when I looked at the photographs from the sale, I kept saying, mm, I'm unsure about this horse, did I do the right thing? And he said, okay dad, I'm backing you, that's my horse. So, so from that day, it's been Daniel's horse, so well done Daniel. And then obviously to Anthony and Angela Beck, um, you know, always a privilege to have these silks, and they support me every sale, um, not many people do. So 
thank you to them and obviously to Abe that's always here to shout them out. The horse, those, his performance today, I use the word five star because I mean I don't know, there's seven star hotels around the world, if it's a seven star performance, it's a seven star performance but I, I fail to you know put an accolade to this performance, the way he disposed of a quality field of young horses. You know he's uh, high class. Um, at the end of the day, you saw what Mrs. G did to her field, and as, a, as they were starting off, he was clear above everybody. He was, he was the best one. And uh, you think the others are going to catch up, but it's almost as though he's just pulled away from them. So uh, I think he's a natural. I think he's a, he's a top horse. And uh, I mean, if you look at his penultimate start, another race that he didn't have a right to win. But uh, good horses pull it out the coals and, and get the job done. You had a lot of memorable days throughout your career thus far, Sean, and you're adding another one to those everlasting memories. Well done, you. Thank you so much. Well done to trainer Sean Terry. He's done an outstanding job, and of course, he cannot do it without the horse and his team, who he's thanked. We congratulate the breeders, Fast Fontaine Stud, and then Abe is going to represent you. I want to say a few words. Come through, Abe. Um, he's going to represent the Bex, as he always does. Always see him in, up in Kauteng whenever they have a winner. And uh, it's, it's a big moment for you representing uh, a dynasty when it comes to uh, names in horse racing because this name is synonymous with South African horse racing. Thank you very much. Uh, I'd like to say congratulations to Fast Fontaine and congratulations to the team, the team uh, club or, or camp. Uh, Anthony Back, Mrs. Back, uh, congratulations. Uh, very well done to the, my friend Richard and the, the guys at the stable. Well done, guys. Keep going. Well, it's time for you to lift that trophy on behalf of the Overders, Abe. So congratulations to the backs. That's the winning trophy for the winning Overders. So that concludes the running of... Thank you so much, Abe. Really appreciate it. And we thank Myers Chetty, chairman of Gold Circle Racing Club and a director of Gold Circle for coming down and assisting us with the winning presentation. A five-star performance by a proper racehorse, a champion in number 11, Lucky Lad. Okay, up next, guys, if you play the win, if you lose, I'll be doing the draw.